being honest with yourself. Like, where are you right now? Do you know what it means to live for yourself? And do you feel that you do it like every day in your personal life? Like, do you feel that the choices that you make, that the values that you hold, the decisions that you make, that they are for your own highest good, that they're for your own well-being? Because sometimes we avoid them out of fear of conflict or fear of rejection. So for example, if we don't want our family or friends to be mad at us for us doing something that's for ourselves, maybe we would avoid it. Or if we don't want our family to be disappointed. So for example, I know that there are, I have a friend and she told me that she had three options for occupations growing up. (laughs) She could be a doctor, an engineer, or uh, I'm blanking on what the third one is. Maybe it was a lawyer or something, but doctor to engineer, I remember. And so it was like, you could be a doctor, an engineer, or let's just say I was a lawyer. And she couldn't choose anything else. Like it was absolutely unacceptable within her family, within the construct for her to choose something else. And so it wasn't authentic to her to live like that, to choose an occupation that she wasn't interested in, right? That's not her living for her. That's her living for her family's expectations. And so where do you fit into all of this? Do you feel that you're able to make decisions in a way that caters to your own happiness, to your own well-being? And if not, what are some of these things that are keeping you in place? And how might we move away from it? 